take a look at the NBA power rankings according to NBA.com. Uh, number one, they have the Celtics. Uh, that's a team the Cavs have beat twice. Bucks, Trailblazers, Nuggets, Jazz, Suns, Mavericks. They have the Cavs at number eight. Offensive rating, 115.5, third best. Defensive rating, we alluded to, 108.7, uh, fourth best. And again, Chris, you pointed out, Darius Garland has missed some time. Donovan Mitchell has missed some time. And that's even more important because you want those guys to get used to playing next to each other. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing about it, right? Like the only way that Darius and Donovan are going to figure out the, the late fourth quarter hierarchy, whatever it's going to end up being, what's best for the Cavs in those moments is to go through it. And sometimes you learn through failure, right? Like sometimes you learn through success and other times you learn through failure. And I think there's been enough failure, especially on the West Coast trip, where it was eye-opening to how they had to play, the approach that they needed to take. Um, but again, these guys got to play together. They got to figure it out. Um, and, and the only way that they're going to get better and they're going to experience the things that this team is going to experience, maybe come playoff time, um, is by going through the moments like we saw on the West Coast road trip. Um, going through moments like we saw in overtime against the Boston Celtics, right? Going through moments that we saw late in the game against the Washington Wizards. All of those kinds of things that have happened throughout the course of this season so far, even though they can be frustrating and disappointing based on the outcome, they're all very, very beneficial to a team that hasn't been through those the same way that Milwaukee, Golden State, Phoenix, Boston, some of these other contenders have already. Yeah, and, and the other thing to keep in mind, and you heard it from Darius Garland, these guys, they're all headed in the right direction. That will usually enable you to get where you need to go reasonably quickly.